I've made the two seemingly biggest mistakes you can make in real estate. I bought my first house in 2007, which probably the top of the market. And I got my real estate license in 2008, which was the beginning of the bottom. So all that to say, it worked out actually beautifully for me. I lived in that house. I loved it. I had a roommate. I lived in there for, let's see, 2007 till 2012. So at 2012, right as we were coming out of that housing downturn, I sold it and I bought a loft that I loved, that I could not have afforded if I hadn't had at least some equity in my house. But during that time that I owned that house, even though I bought it at the top of the market, I still made money when I sold it, but I also improved it and I enjoyed it. I had a yard for my dog. I had a place to live. I had like this pride of ownership. It wasn't just about that I was looking for it to appreciate 10 or 15 or 20% year over year, which those were the pandemic boom years. And I don't think that's, we can't be looking for that again. That's not, that's not gonna happen. We're going back to a normal appreciation rate. But I loved the house and it was a stepping stone to me getting the next one. So even though I made the two biggest mistakes, it totally worked out.